welcome. My name is Jimmy Mulligan, and I am a traveling consultant for Earth America International. And today with me is my dance partner and the beautiful Alina Sharapova. Hi. And we are at the beautiful Arthur Murray Lincolnshire studio. And today, in this edition of Arthur's Footsteps, we would like to show you uh, a way to develop and work on your West Coast Swing basics and your basic figures. So we're gonna utilize them a lot. We're gonna break them down a little bit. We're gonna give you a very solid grouping that's very consistent. You're gonna follow it over and over and over. I'm gonna make you at home say it with me at times, okay? So, uh, the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna talk about, these are the figures that we're gonna use the most, and these are the figures that make up the overwhelming majority of the things that we do in West Coast Swing, okay? So, those figures in total are star step, side passes, sugar pushes, and whips. And in today's version, we're going to focus on the associate bronze, so bronze one and two version. So we're only going to do a star step, side pass, sugar push, side pass, sugar push, and finally a side pass to put it all back together into a closed position. So every time we start the grouping and when we finish the grouping, we'll be in closed position. Now, even though we are trying to uh, respect the physical distancing, um, so we're not actually going to touch, but you'll still get the idea, and we'll show you. So if you're at home, as the leader or the follower, you should be able to do this by yourself. If you and or your significant other take dance lessons at Arthur Murray and you're at home, well, then you certainly can practice this together. So our first thing we're going to do, we would be in a West Coast Swing closed dance position. We're facing each other. First thing we're going to do is start off with a star step. Very simple. It's two triple steps. The second one's a little bit different, so watch, pay close attention. So we go triple step and then we go anchor away you're going to hear me say that anchor a lot right so we're away from each other now on a side pass i'm going to open up the door one she's facing me she's still facing me she's still facing me i let her go and then we're five and six so we'll come back over here so we have a starter step and then we go from starter step into a side pass or specifically a left side pass but it falls into the side pass category so Starter step, anchor step, one, close two, three, cross four for her, five, back six. Next thing we're going to do is a sugar push. You probably know this, but I'm going to give you this version. So we're going to go one, I close my feet, two, three, and four, five, and again, back six on the anchor step. That anchor is very important. That's like West Coast Swing's thing is it's anchor. It's what sets it apart from any other dance that we do. We're going to do a right side pass now. So I would do one, close my feet, lift the hand, three and four, five, back, six. Leaders, very important thing. You've heard me say, I lift my hand because I lift it. I don't pull. So if we go back onto this side, I don't want to go one and pull. I want to go one, close my feet, lift the hand, three and four. Make a little tunnel for her to go through. Five, back, six. Now, shoulder push. One, two three and four five back six this next thing is a right side pass she's going to put her back to me just like the other right side pass on a normal scenario i'm going to touch her back okay that says hey we're done traveling and we're going to finish in a closed position so i would go one lift two touch three and four and finish together now we're not going to anchor we're going to go five and slightly to the side on six Okay, now we've started all over again. Triple step, anchor away. One, close, two, three, and four, five, back, six, sugar, push. Two, three, and four, five, back, six, right side pass. Two, three, and four, five, back, six, and one, two, three, and four, five, back, six, and then final right side pass to close it. One, two, three, and four, five, and six, and we would start all over with triple step, triple step. Now, we're going to do that a few times. We're going to kind of go through it and dance it through, um, but a couple little things to uh, take note of. Leaders, again, I'm not pulling. If I'm connected to my hand and I move back, everything moves, that's plenty. All right, and then this is great. So we all get to kind of, if you practice it, not even touch it. That's really, really good too, because it's going to teach us how to dance over our own feet and move our own bodies and not push and pull on our partners. Okay, so uh, again, here's our grouping: start a step, 
side pass, sugar push, side pass, sugar push, side pass. Okay, say it again with me. Ready? We have starter step, side pass, sugar push, side pass, sugar push, side pass. And then we're back to the beginning, so it's a good thing I'm leaving. Um, so, okay, we're going to do that over and over and over today. So we're going to do that two times all the way through, starting right now. So we would have starter step. Anchor step and one. I close two. She goes three and four. Five back six and one. Close two. Four and four. Five and six. You'll notice on that four, it's a very small step, so it's not huge. And then again, right side pass. One, two, three and four. Five shoulder push and one, two, three and four. Five right side pass and one, two, three and four. Close it up. Triple step, triple step. One, close two, three and four, five and shoulder push. One, two, three and four, five and right side pass. One, two, three and four, five back six, shoulder push. Two, three and four, five back six and one, two, pick her up and five and six and it would start all over. Make sense? Good, so same things, okay? All the way through, one more time. Uh, well, two more times, all the way through, not stopping, okay? And again, our order, we're gonna go through it two times, our starter step, side pass, sugar push, side pass, sugar push, side pass, and we start all over. So we have six things to do, we're gonna do that twice. We need to go, triple step, triple step, and one, two, three, and four, five, and six, sugar push, Two, three, and four, five, right side pass, and one, two, three, and four, five, and six, shoulder push, two, three, and four, right side pass, pick her up, two, three, and four, and start all over, triple step, anchor step, and one, two, three, and four, five, and six, and shoulder push, two, three, and four, Five back six, side pass. Two, three, and four. Five back six, shoulder push. Two, three, and four. Let's bring it on home. And one, two, three, and four, five, and six. And we can start again. My encouragement, our encouragement, is that you put on a song or two or ten and just do that over and over and over. You'll see Alina and I, we have some different footwork kind of variations on the shoulders push specifically, two things. One thing to note is we utilize the triple steps on counts three and four, as opposed to a tap step. Tap step is not wrong, so if you're newer into your associate bronze program, the tap step is totally fine. But as we progress, we wanna start working on our footwork and developing our footwork. So if you can go three and four, we always believe that that's a little bit better, okay? So again, she'll also see as we do our shoulder push, she's gonna do more of a modern or contemporary version. So it's like forward together, or forward and back. So one, two, forward and back, anchor step. If you wanna do a more traditional, Version, you would stay back in either a third position, that means her right foot slightly behind her left, or go ahead and just close it as we go one, two, three, and four. We want to be careful not to turn out too much so leaders don't pull her in. Five and six. So we still face each other, come over the top, three and four, five and six. So you'll see Alina turning out, and that's probably about the maximum amount of turnout. So you want to not do too much, okay? All right, very good. So now, that's great. You guys are all pros. You're doing great at that. Okay, maybe not pros yet, but you're going to do that a bunch, and then we're going to upgrade it, okay? Still in the associate bronze level. Same six parts. Starter step, side pass, sugar push, side pass, sugar push, side pass, okay? All right, same thing. Leaders, just like when Arthur Murray used to put down the footprints and we would put our feet on there back in the 1918s and that area, same kind of thing, no new footwork, exact same footwork this whole time for the rest of today. We're going to go triple step, triple step. I'm going to give her an inside turn, two, three, and four, five, back, six. And even the followers, they hit the same spots on the floor that they did before. Shorter push with the tuck turn right in front of me, one, two, three, and four, five, back, six. 
I'm going to give her an outside turn, which is two and a half turns. If you're at home, it gets a little challenging. One and a half is okay, but we'll show you a cool version. So we go one turn, two, keep turning, hand change. Three and four, five and six. Now, I'm just going to do a little face loop. Shoulder push. Two, put it over her head. Four, five and six. Right side pass. One, two, three and four. Okay? Now, this is where I'm picking her up. Five and six. So we can start all over. We'll do it from this side. Triple step. Anchor step. One. Inside turn. Three and four. Five and six. One. High five. Three and four. Five. Outside turn. Right side pass. Two. Hand change. Three and four. Five and six. I'm going to pick my head this time. Three and four. Five and six. Right side pass, pick it up from the top, triple step, from the top starts now. Triple step and triple step. We're going to dance that through without stopping with the variations. If you want to keep dancing with us, just do the basics because again, I'm using the exact same footwork. You're going to time up with us perfectly. Ready? Five, six, here we go. And triple step, triple step. One, prep, two, turn, three, and four. Five and six. One, two, three and four. Five and six. Outside turn. Close two. Three and four. Five and six. I'll put this over her head. Two, three and four. Five. Right side pass. And one, two, three and four. We're back and closed. And six. Start over. Triple step. I said it wouldn't stop. Sorry. And one, two, three and four. Five back six. And one, two. Two, high five and four, five and outside turn, one, two, and change and four, five and six, and one, I'll put it over my head this time, three and four, five and six, and then finally, one, two, three and four, five and six, and we start it all over. Cool? All right. If you feel like you're doing really, really well, do that over and over again. And again, the order stays the same. You can do the basic, and then you can do the one with the variations. Basics and variations, and basics and variations. Same six patterns. Guess what? We're gonna give you one more fun thing to play with, okay? Again, no timing changes, no changes in the order of our figures. So we do star step, side pass, sugar push, side pass, sugar push, side pass to finish. We're doing the exact same turns. We're just going to play with the hands a little bit to make them look a little bit different. I like being cool, right? So in this first star step, we go triple step. I might let go right away. Full step. There it is. Free hand. Hey, mom. No left hand. And one, two, three, and four. She does a free spin. Five and six. Okay? So you'll watch how my body rotates to help lead that turn a little bit, okay? Then same sugar push with the tuck as early. One. Two, I started with my left hand, but I finish it with my right hand. That's fancy, sneaky, right? So now I right hand to her left hand. Normally we would be here, but now we're here. Same double outside turn that we did before. One, but it's inside now. Three and four, five and six. And then I'm going to do an inside turn off the shoulder push. Two, three and four, five and six. Right side pass. One, two, three and link. Five and six, start all over. Triple step, no hand, triple step. One prep, two turn, three and four. Five and six, shoulder push. Two, three and four, five and six. And one turn, two, three and four, five and six. And inside turn, three and four, five and six. Finish it up, one, two, three and four. Five and six, and we can start all over, so on and so forth. Okay, so again, same six pieces. There are only three figures that we use today. I didn't do any footwork variations. Everything I did as the leader stayed the same the whole way through. Feel free to pause the video, speed it up, slow it down, probably slow it down if you want to see where our feet go a little bit more. And uh, again, say it with me one more time. Start a step, side pass, sugar push, Side pass, sugar push, side pass. That takes you back to the beginning, okay? So, best of luck. In the 1950s, during the Arthur Murray uh, dance party television show that 
that aired weekly on all of the major television stations, Catherine Murray will finish each program by saying, add some fun in your life, try dancing. What we would like to say today is, let's keep some fun in our, our lives and let's keep dancing. Thank you all. On behalf of Arthur Murray International, thanks for having me. I hope this was helpful. And stay safe and we can't wait to be back dancing with you as soon as possible.